Oh, she won't shut up. <laughs> okay, drop up. No. That. No. Okay. We need more items then. But we can't find them at the moment, so. Okay, I just want to check there's nothing of use on this floor, which, looking at that, is incorrect. Right, hammer. Can we use that with a chipper? Yeah. Okay. So, oh, good time for that. Fucking hell. Uh, right, let's go up these stairs. We won't use the legs, we've almost solved a puzzle, so our son he can just regrow. Servants avoided him, yet we knew they were there. They all smelled of spiced wine, a mystic scent permeated by club and sage. You've just seen someone mi message me called Bloody Riddle, I think. Uh, shit. Come on, rocks. Shift yourself, there we go. Last one now. No? You're not gonna get the fuck out the way. Come on. Oh, you bastards. Okay, maybe that one needs to move first. No, will it? No. Alright. Let's throw those down now. Back off, rogue. As much as I'd like to help you, I think it's too late. Okay, let's just follow this left wall. Let's see what we can find. Right. Oh shit. 
shit, what the fuck? Ugh. You're disgusting! <laughs> oh no, I can't hit him. There we go. <laughs> How do we tip rotate? There we go. Rusty Pete. Oh no, hang on, put it there, put it there. Oh, did you hear that sound now? Look how bloody close that rat is to it, too. <laughs> That's quite the shite, buddy. <laughs> That's what you get for going being up to fucking kinky shit. With your chains. 2nd of August, 1839. I have arrived at the village of Altstadt. It's a haven in the midst of a vast forest and the last stop before my final destination, Castle Brennenburg. It's late in the evening and the outrider, who has been with the coach since Bremen, advised me to wait until morning before I venture further. I've arranged for a bed at Der Müller, the village's only inn, and am now waiting for the sun to rise. I try to sleep, but as I close my eyes, I see the men who fell victim in London. My fear and shame forces me to witness the same scenes over and over. They are dead because of me. Because of Rhea. Leroy Jenkins. Yeah. Oh shit, hello. I'm not gonna shout Leroy Jenkins to kill that like team out. Hey, anybody, help! Christ, I don't believe this. I mean, why? What do I do to deserve this? I mean, it can't be. Do I deserve this? It wasn't my fault. Why did he have to go in there? Don't go into burning houses. He should have known better. Is this us? Sounds like we've been put in here because... Um... We technically killed them, but we didn't really. They kind of went in there. Is that our insanity? No. It's in very poor condition, right? Let's try this. Okay. Let's try this. Why don't we break it? It needs to be weakened further. Oh. Where's the rock? Well, it's for his own Hey, you! Stop! Don't come any closer! I just want to leave! You can't go outside! It's too dangerous! I'm telling Gabriel! I doubt that very much. Ooh, let that so is Gabriel. be ready. Let there be enough time. Oh shit, hello. Oh no! I don't like you! Go away! How close is he? How close is he? Oh, it's gonna be pretty close. Okay, no bloody dead ends, no bloody dead ends. Shit, there's more than one of them. I feel like I have fled the world and all its worries. Brennenburg is a majestic creation perched upon a forest-clad hill with towers reaching well above even the highest pine trees. Following the winding road leading to the gates gives the impression of discovering something forgotten, as if journeying with Marco Polo to the hidden Xanadu. Alexander, the Baron, is a peculiar but gracious man. He seems well versed in worldly matters and is not at all as eccentric as I assumed. My room is exquisite and I'm confident that no hotel for miles could even hope to match it. As the sun sets on Brennenburg, 
its fairy tale varnish turns to an eerie gloom. Alexander's strange servants are never far away. They are a quiet lot, and their behavior could only be described as skulking. Alexander seems pleased by my presence. As he puts it, it seems like I got here just in time. Okay. Interesting. smashed no there's some oil which means I think that oh we can start using the thing probably again yay So that's the back of your ass, even. Uh, right. So we follow this. Get her back! So we're really after this girl, aren't we? I mean, that sounds like us at least. Two system entrance, but we can't get in there. An empty glass container. Right. What can we put in there then? That's empty. That won't budge. Okay. Uh, I'm not gonna put all four in, even though that would fill up our thing, just because it seems very wasteful and also it means I'm not overusing it. gets like emptier and emptier I do actually start using it more carefully right okay we just put it down here so it's now empty that bit um, that's a very good oh that's the other side okay that's the other side of where we just were 
where that thing cornered us earlier. This is a empty room with nothing of value in. Um, okay. It's going left again. Oh, hello. This is new, I think. Yeah, this is definitely... Oh, no, it's not. This is old, but I don't think we went this way before. Yeah, what's in here? Anything in here? Ooh, hello. Hey, is that on? It's not on. Ew, that disgusting plate of food. 4th of August, 1839. The nightmares woke me in the early morning, and for a moment I forgot where I was. Shortly after, there was a knock on my door. Alexander had heard my screams and asked me to join him in the parlour. As we drank our tea, Alexander began to tell me what he knew. It seems like the orb I found casts a long and dark shadow. It's not only a powerful item, but a dangerous one. Simply by touching it, you invoke the powers within, and if you are too weak to control it, it will devour you. The shadow is a sluggish thing, lagging behind the wielder, killing anyone or anything in its path to reclaim the orb. I said I didn't care about its powers, and that I should throw it away. Alexander advised against this, as I'd still be a part of the path to the orb, and eventually suffer death. Having the orb, I would at least have the chance to fight back when the time came. I asked Alexander what he meant when he said he could protect me, and he answered that things can be done, but at a price. He's trying to kill us, I reckon. Because of, oh. Fuck this, China. Fuck off. Fancy a plate. Um, <laughs> anyway, uh, back to serious. At a price usually means at your death, I can help you. But maybe not. Maybe it's just me being cynical. Fire. Still burns plates. Oh, hello. Who are you? Oh, shit. Some sort of acid. Yep, yeah, should have done it with that. Ah, oh, shit. Use your acid? No, no good. Slow. 
Lolly. Use the acid on this. There we go. And oh, right. And now we use this. There we go. Just gonna shut this and run away. Okay. The dark towers of Brennenberg rose above the forest and were silhouetted against the snow white moon. You can have feeling sad for some reason. So you used the drain sewers as a means of transport? Yes, they were built to divert water from an underground spring and are quite spacious. It seemed only natural to incorporate it into the overall structure. But we won't be using it. Not today. The flow is seasonal, Not today. and when the spring runs dry, the damp tunnels produce a rather poisonous type of fungi. There is an antidote, of course, but we won't be bothering with it today. Come, this way instead. We're almost there. I have a feeling he didn't tell us the antidote for a very good reason. Oh no, it's not one of our bloody... Oh no. The water is too deep to the first. Don't want to hear the bloody memento when we're up to thank you. This door is going to be too heavy to open. Yep. Uh, no way we're getting up there, so we've got to rise the water somehow. That somehow is. Don't believe we're stuck. It needs gear. Need its gears need to be greased. Okay. Any way we can do that from here? So I really don't want to go back in that room. We might have to. Uh, no. The vessel is needed to carry the... Oh. That's not a vessel. The vessel is a boat. Which I'll settle with that. Alright, it's gears. Hopefully I can just put it in there. Down it goes. No? What happened now? Broken pipes were rocking the ladder, however, it's somewhat damaged by the impact. Right, Let's see if we can impact it some more. No? Okay. Let's use a chipper. Can't use this item this way. Let's use the drill. No. Let me make sure that bloody calls. Bring it back up maybe. And then there we go. Just keep doing that. There we go. Bada boo. Easy fucking peasy. The control room. The blue light blinded him as it was done inside that murky tomb in Algeria. It was just an enchanting, and he tried to approach it, but the Baron's firm hand held him down. Herbert, how did we find this place? An old friend back in Algiers gave me a map. Why is it we can kill you here, you Daniel, my boy? He wanted to, Daniel, but things don't always turn out the way we plan. Because we kill each other. <laughs> Ooh. Hello. I don't know where I'm going. We're just in random directions, are we? 
see, this, this room's a dead end, so let's explore here first. There's pipes. There's pressure somewhere. Okay. Nothing helpful in here, I don't think. Let's go and check another room. That was a good thing to do, but hey, -ho, we've done it now. Wooden crank, right? Maybe crank it out of its place. No. Okay. What's this one? Oh, this is just a dead end door. Let's move up. It's not right. Oh. No. Right. Let's get through here. this. No. Okay, pipes. There's a loose pipe. Okay. So let's bring that to here. Just so we can come back for it if we need. Um, these can be moved. And this probably undoes, undoes even the other ones. No, in fact, let's not do anything until we've checked what we need to do over in here. So, what do we need to move these for? Stuck, stuck, stuck. Okay, let's just let's put everything up for now. Might need to change that later. But right now, let's just put it all up. something up there that we need to get down. I think. Okay, that, that doesn't work. Alright. Okay, yeah. Wood against wood won't do anything, however, what will a rock do? Let's go find out. No, that doesn't quite get there. Maybe if I jump? Can I jump through? Yeah, I can. Okay. No. Nope. That won't do anything. What about smaller rock like that? Nope. Can't pick that up. Maybe we need to stand on a crate? Okay, yeah, let's try standing on a crate like that. And then throwing the rock. So, pick up the rock. Standing on two boxes to get up there. So I have a feeling this gear is needed for something. Now, try picking up a rock and then going up. I've put into the machine is unequaled by the reasoning of any man. A thought that generations of men have passed away since I first entered to reconstruct the design is most tiring. Limitation of this world has made my work incredibly difficult. It has forced me to build a thing almost a hundred times.
times larger than the delicate contraption it tries to emulate. Not to mention a flow of tan lighting crudely replaced by pressured steam pushing its way through pipes and turbines. It shames me to think of what the inventor would have thought of my monster. Where he worked with magnifying glass to carefully fix all the parts, I pushed five men to erect a tower of wrought iron in the hope it will have even the tiniest hint of power found in the traveller's locket. Okay, so this machine's been made again and again and again. Stuck in position. So what did I do? Both rooms, maybe? I'm really not sure what I'm like, what meant to be doing at all. Maybe this isn't well enough. Maybe like it's a puzzle each, or it's like only one puzzle one side. Either way, let's get that pipe over the fuck up there. Where do I put the bloody pipe? Where do I put that pipe? Where do I put the bloody pipe? I've lost the pipe. Good day. Where do me? Um, where have I put the bloody pipe? Where have I put my pipe? Uh, that'll be a really good packing. Oh, there we go. That's the pipe, right? Okay. Oh, why not? Go, go, go. Pipe. Right, what else? I mean, I honestly don't know what the feck we're meant to be doing. There's no like sign of what I'm meant to be doing. Return to the system. No, we don't want to do that yet. Unless we do? Are we meant to be sending these things into the system? Because for some reason we can't just take it through the door? Uh. Huh. What are we meant to be doing? I really don't know. Hmm. trying to achieve. Well, I know that it's going to be a hell of a lot easier. So why don't I know? That stuff. That stuff. That stuff. That stuff. However we do have a wooden crank. Um, so for now let's assume that these rooms are completely finished. If we assume those rooms are done. Oh, hello, idea about that one. Oh, shit. Let's see if we can get in. Okay, let's. And then go through there, put the crank down. Because the gear's got to be. So the crank. No. Uh. No object to use on. I don't know what you want to feckin' use on it, do I? Okay. You know what? I think we'll figure this out for another part. So if you have any ideas, put it in the comments below. Um, it's probably going to mean Thea's not done as much for a bit, but that's fine. Um, okay, yeah. Basically, we've got we've got four puzzles. I think we've got this puzzle. I don't know if I've done it by accident. I don't know if I'm meant to put something in there and then bring it out or what. Um, we've got the pipes in the other room. Let's show them again in a second. So yeah, these two rooms exactly the same, same as in the other part of this hall. This I don't know what these are. These, this room's for, apart from that, apart from that uh, gear. I don't know how to get up there. 
So there's actually two puzzles in that room, so that's four already, including the pipes. So there's three at the moment in this room. And then you've got the pipes. You've got these things. I don't know what we're trying to achieve with these at all. The other one I thought, oh, okay, let's try and get it down. Um, unless you've got to, like, unleash it to bang this. But, I mean, I'm going as fast as I can, really. Oh, wait, yeah, I'm going as fast as I can, man. Yeah, and that didn't do much. I mean, you can hear clicking with some. That's a clear click. I don't know what that actually does, or what that means, or what we're trying to achieve with that. So that's puzzle number five. Uh, these pipes, these U-bend pipes, I'm not sure what to do. Um, and... Uh, and yeah. So, one, two, three, four, five, and then last puzzle, something's got to do with this, a crank for a machine, but what machine, I really don't know, is it this one, it doesn't look like it's this one, it cannot be used this way, oh hang on, maybe, we put this down, this is my last idea of the day, and then I am going to call it, so it can't be used this way. So that suggests that the item is used for this. Just not in the way I'm trying to make it at the moment. So, any ideas you have, put them in the comments below. Um, I might look it up before you can do that. But either way, just put comments in of what you think I need to do. So, until next time, this has been Dark Lair with uh with amnesia, haha, <laughs> there's the pun. I forgot it, what it was called. Just like having amnesia, ha <laughs> Not me fucking up at all. Right. This has been Amnesia, the Dark Descent. Although it's pretty light in here, it's confusing as fuck. Anyway, so until next time, goodbye.